Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are getting to visit the Plantation House who is owned by Mr. and Miss Reeves in Huntsville, Arkansas. It is a beautiful home and I'm so excited to share it with you. Today I won't be doing a lot of talking because I believe that this home speaks for itself for sure. But I will be giving a little bit of information on different aspects of the home. Their home appears as it has been around for centuries. But she reports that they built it in 2003. Miss Reeves grew up in many homes with this same historical feel and her love has grown for history and antiques over the years. Miss Reeves not only works a full-time job with the VA, she keeps an immaculate home and she holds events such as tea parties and dinners, weddings and other events. I'm not sure how she fits it all in. Here is their tea party area with a beautiful view and serene setting. I love the chandelier that she has hung over the table with candles, LED candles, and her beautiful pumpkin centerpiece. Who wouldn't want to have tea here? Their home is set on hundreds of acres and it's not only a venue for some events but it's also a working farm with cattle and horses. Here is her rose garden, which at this time, the beauty has faded with the weather, but I'm going to insert a picture to show how beautiful her roses are in full bloom. The home is set up like most historical homes. When you come in the front door, you can see all the way through to the back door. There's two setting rooms on either side as you first walk in. The first room on the left is their music room with a beautiful baby grand piano and loads of beautiful antiques. Miss Reeves has obviously worked hard with her husband to grow their collection over the years and make their home what it is today with all of the beautiful pieces. The room to the right is the office area or library with many, many collections that they have on display here.
Mr. Reeves collects hunt scenes and has many on display here. And they were friends with a gentleman who owned racehorses and he wanted them to have his trophy, which is on display on the table. This beautiful piano made of rosewood was built in 1856. Miss Reeves said it took eight men to get it into the house and it stayed where it sits now. This beautiful dining room is where Miss Reeves holds many dinners and it also holds many collections that she has gathered through the years. Many pieces were given to her by friends and other pieces she has found along the way. This dining room is not only a place where she holds dinners for others, but it's also a place where she feeds her own family, her husband, her children, and her grandchildren. She has so many beautiful pieces, her and her husband, that if we tried to go through each one, we could tour this home for days. But if you have a question about any certain piece, please comment below and myself or Miss Reeves will try to answer.
Today we will only be touring the first level of the home, but Miss Reeves has invited us back to come for Christmas with all its beautiful decorations, and we will be touring the full three levels. We are now coming into the main sitting room on the first level. They also have a family room on the third level as well. This beautiful blue suede sofa they purchased at Sam's Furniture and it's absolutely stunning. Miss Reeves has decorated with pheasants and I believe they said a family member has harvested the pheasant that's in the corner. Her kitchen is beautiful and it speaks for itself. Many of her collections have a story to go with them. The canister set in the windowsill there came from her mother. And her mother placed a note inside the canister, giving a history on it and a note to her beloved daughter. Miss Reeves said that this is something she practiced, her mother practiced with all of her antique items. We are now going into the main floor bathroom. The wall color is such a surprising, bright, beautiful color. It definitely makes a bright space. A beautiful backdrop for her antique items. This room is a room in process. They have many beautiful items as well as some family photos displayed on the walls. Each picture hung has quite the story to tell. We are now going out to the back deck that they have added on not too long ago. This is where they hold many of the events.
It is such a beautiful, relaxing space. Also, a deck the same size as this one that you can get to through the spiral staircase. They don't currently allow any events to take place utilizing this space due to safety concerns. But it's a space that they can enjoy. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have enjoyed the tour of Mr. and Mrs. Reeves' home as much as I have.